Holiday decorations can spruce up the inside and outside of a home or business and even have the ability to bring that sense of holiday cheer. In one local town, though, decorations are said to be saving Christmas. Nicole Christine traveled to Brazil, Indiana today to see firsthand these displays. She joins us now with details of a really good story. Nicole. Yeah, some holiday cheer. No kidding. And you know, Tom, this became a hot button issue when they renovated downtown right. Brazil along US 40 mm -hmm. uh, a few years ago. The renovations included new roads and sidewalks and also new light poles, which weren't electric and couldn't support the usual Christmas lights display. But as with any holiday story, there is a happy ending as the community pulled together to light up Main Street and reconnect with the light inside themselves. The town of Brazil, Indiana, wasn't entirely Good. merry at the beginning of this holiday season. People were saying that Grinch was in town and that there was, it just didn't feel like Christmas this year. That feeling from some of the locals came from a lack of Christmas lights up and down Main Street, an absence felt by one little girl in particular. It was kind of like a big deal because Brazil isn't really lighted up all over the streets. And Christmas is almost the specialist, well, special holiday. Adelie's thoughts on the lack of lights spurred a family member to action, donating $25 to Brazil Main Street to decorate one of the light poles. A holiday gesture that inspired Brazil Main Street members and led to a Facebook post asking for people to sponsor their own poles. We thought we'd get two, two, three, four more and maybe some $10 to $15 donations, but by the end of that night we had, I think, 18 or 19 poles completely sponsored. And then the holiday trend took an even more touching turn as people began donating in memory of loved ones they're missing this season. People like Braylon Medeiros, who lost her two-year-old son Braxton in 2017. In the holidays, I dread them, didn't want to put my Christmas decorations up, didn't want to, but making this bow just like gave me a little bit of a boost to get through this holiday season. Medeiros says Braxton's decorated pole helps her to know his memory is alive in Brazil. The biggest fear of, I think, a grieving parent is that your child will be forgotten. And just to drive down the road and see his name means absolutely everything. And for Adelie, there's a sense that the decorations aren't just lighting up the street, but also the heart of her community. I feel like I brightened it up a little, spread the cheer. And I agree with Adelie. I think she did that too. And while she is quite the inspiration, Adelie and her mother Shakira were quick to say that none of this would have happened without the help of Brazil Main Street workers like Josh, who they feel are year-round sources of light for their community. Excuse me while I wipe away some of these tears. Yeah, what a what beautiful, a beautiful story. Yeah. I understand, though, that they're not taking any more donations, right? No, they aren't. And it's not for any bad reasons. It's no. for good reasons. They ran out of supplies. Uh, there are over <laughs> 30 poles decorated now. No kidding. And they had to buy a lot of the supplies from Amazon and stores in other cities, Josh was telling me, because huh. of, you know, lack of supplies in Brazil. Uh, but he is encouraging those who donated in honor of someone to put up bows like the one we saw Braylon put oh, up for man. Braxton in the story. So That Adley, what a cutie patootie. Oh, yeah, and what oh. a great person already. No kidding, great story. Thank, Thank you. you. Nicole, meanwhile.